cold is ready. And I'm sure that this is going to be a, a really great meal put on by uh, the, the national staff that we used to have. And, uh, <laughs> Yay. And now they've all gone on to bigger and better things, right? So, Why do they all come to California instead of Italy? I don't know. They were smart. So, uh, anyway, I, I want to especially thank uh, Tommy, as I know her, but Amy and Lido, uh, for hosting us here at their home, yeah. and all of the national staff for this, what I know is going to be a great meal that we're all going to enjoy. So let's give them all a hand. Right. Now, what we'd like to do is very quickly just go right around and give your name, and then uh, if We'd like to have you guys tell us who you were working with at, at Erie. Okay? So, so we're, so we're going we're gonna to start with Randy here and see if any of them were working with Randy. We so all Randy. go by our initials or what? Yeah. Yeah. RXB? Yeah. <laughs> RXB. And the first thing you have to understand is. Everybody that knows me for a long time, like Ronnie, knows it's RXB. But nobody knows why. And the answer is there was a guy that was smarter than me called Dick Bradfield. Uh, Dick Bradfield was a, a giant in the profession. And he had come to Erie ahead of me, and his initials were RB, and my initials for RB, so Bob Chandler just put an X right in the middle. <laughs> and that's how I got there. Now I've talked enough, so... Uh, <laughs> I, I'm June Borby. Um, I worked with uh, Mike Shampoo for years before, and uh, as a laborer. My name is Arlene Advento Borby, the wife of this guy. <laughs> I uh, worked with Akim Doberman at Erie uh, as a junior uh, researcher uh, and uh, a graduate student in UNL, Nebraska. So, that's it. My name is Val Chango, Valentino Chango. I work at the uh, Ag Engineering Department with Don Keter, John McManamy, uh, Clarence Backup, and at the end I work with Amir Khan uh, as a design engineer. That's a long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> 1980, 1983. Uh, George Patina, I worked with uh, Shuichi Sida and then Ben Bergara and Ernest Nang. There you go. I'm Cesar, I never worked at Erie. <laughs> <laughs> but I got affiliated with Erie being the spouse of Chela. <laughs> Pompey Santa Cruz, um, I work with first Dr. Wada, then with uh, Dr. Ken Kasman, then with uh, DG, my XB, uh, Dr. Ziegler, Bob Ziegler. <laughs> then with, uh, then with uh, of course, Apo Jim, I call him Apo Jim. Because uh, for us, Filipino, that he used to call me, just call me Jim, but I cannot call him because uh, uh, it's a respect. So I called him, uh, uh, until now, I'm calling him Apo Jim. <laughs> Apo means uh, the old man. <laughs> I think there's still another one. I mean, I'm missing another one. Oh, I'm Cello Abrinilla. I have. Uh, ah, yeah. I start. Cello, can I break? Yes. With Paul Marco, Dr. Marco, and also Mark Bell. <laughs> 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 Sorry. I stayed there for. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Uh, my name is Cello Abernilla. I work with. Uh, I started at Erie in 1985 and left in 2003. I have a long history of bosses. So I started with Keith Ingram, Keith Moody, SK Dedata, Upendra Singh, Martin Croft, <laughs> <laughs> and then 
Bob Sigler and now Jimmy. I might have forgotten somewhere along the path. <laughs> I'm Ellen Tumimbang. I work with Dr. Glenn Gregorio, but under the division leadership of Dr. McKill and Dr. Kush at that time. I'm Tito. I work close to Erie, so I came to know her. <laughs> I'm Paul Nelson. The only relation to Erie that I have is my wife used to work. Uh, I'm Lali. I used to work in biometrics under Dr. McLaren. I'm Emma Labios Tianco. I was a student assistant at the multiple cropping with uh, Dr. Morris. I'm Celeste Patina. I work with FNP or Dr. Panampiruma and Dr. Ule Nuye. I'm Kilita Jaivir. I was doing my master's research uh, in the Department of Plant Physiology with Dr. Vergara. I'm Alicia. I'm Kilita's niece. <laughs> I'm by the, sorry. <laughs> by the way, I'm Gamani's wife over there. <laughs> uh, I'm uh, Alita McKill. I, I work at Erie for uh, uh, 10 years and I work with uh, Dr. Bonman. And then when Dr. Bonman left, I guess I replaced, and that's uh, was uh, <laughs> that's uh, under Dr. Creel. Uh, he's the department head of plant pathology. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, my name is John, and uh, I'm an exchange student from China. Uh, now I live in Chelo's house. Uh, this is my first time to go abroad, and. Uh, I'm nervous and <laughs> I don't know how to, yeah, uh, have a good time everyone, thank you. I'm a part of China. You know. Um, I'm Marge Litzinger, we were at Erie from 1974 until 1992 and my husband's an entomology was over there. <laughs> Photographer. <laughs> Official photographer. I, got, I, I know I got this, but I'm a friend yeah. of Joselito Real's for the past 15 oh. years, and I came out to just enjoy and okay. meet some of the folks here. I'm Gamini Jaimir. I did master's in Dr. Purnapiru, FNP. Same lab as. Uh, yes. Same department. Same department. <laughs> I'm Gurdev Kosh. I was at Erie from 1967 to 2002. Hi, I'm Karen Hill. I'm Jim Hill's wife, and we spent a wonderful sabbatic year at Erie um, from 1989 to 1989. Uh, no, 88 89. <laughs> I know. Anyway, it was a fantastic year, and we loved it. I'm Kevin Murphy. I'm a F1 hybrid of <laughs> Hugh, Hugh and Joanne Murphy. So we were there from 1972 to 1985. So I'm Jim Litzinger. I was I'm a husband of Marge, so we were there 18 years. And I work for Short Heinrichs and Hubert Zanstra. I'm Peter Hobbs. Um, I work with Dick Harwood. I was out of reach in Bangladesh. And then, des <laughs> then decided that Can't rice was too hot a crop to work with and switched to uh, simit, working on wheat, and then I got back into rice, rice and wheat. I was there from 74 to 80. I'm Nancy Heinrichs, and I'm married to him. He's an entomologist, and I was, we were there from 75 to 85. My name is Elvis Heinrichs, and nobody knows who that is. I'm also known as Short, and most people may not even know who that is. But if there was anybody from the food service department, what, what would we call that? Uh, uh, well, we, had, we had coffee in that time. Yeah. Anyway. Cafeteria. Yeah, yeah, cafeteria. I was the one person who, when they had rice, yeah, always I asked for milk yes. and sugar with <laughs> my rice. Right. Oh. <laughs> and they, nobody could understand. <laughs> 75 to 85, and I'm all through the park. Rice pudding. Oh, I'm Neil Rutger. I'm a retired rice geneticist. I live right here in Woodland, about two miles north here. Uh, I was never actually employed at Erie, but I was a frequent visitor there for 
a decade or so, especially when I was a scientific liaison officer to, uh, to Erie. And I spent my career either at Davis or Stuttgart or Arkansas. I'm Ronnie Kaufman. I was at Erie from 71 to 81. Kaufman C, that is, not to be confused with Kaufman K. People thought my wife's name was Kay Kaufman. <laughs> but it's really Charlotte. <laughs> so, and she wishes she could be here, but uh, maybe next time. Hi, my name is Amy. I'm the wife of this guy here. <laughs> and um, I worked at Erie as a student assistant under the supervision of um, Lisa Yamba, who was working with um, Dr. Keith Ingram at the time. Uh, I'm Lito Real. I worked with Erie for 10 years. I work with many people at Erie. Mostly I work with Jim Hill when he was there. I work with uh, John O'Toole and then with SK Didata. And I have helped many other also, many other scientists across various departments. I'm Bob Ziegler. I was, uh, had a real job at Erie from uh, 92 <laughs> to 99 where I actually produced something. And since 2005, I've been uh, Director General. Dave McHale, I was in the plant breeding uh, from 82 to 91, and again from 2001 to 2011. Harold uh, Kaufman, or K. Kaufman, at Erie from 67 through 81. Uh, plant pathology and IRTP. Russ Freed, Indonesia 1972, uh, Erie 76, and Sri Lanka 1977. To 1980. Ruby Freed, I hung out with him. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you lucky? <laughs> Newcomers. Somebody came in late, I think. So we're just. Gene, can you do a selfie? Oh, I'll have to. No, no, you have to turn the lens around. Right. Yeah, sure. You're great. Okay. Yeah. Birdman. I'm, uh, I'm Gene Heddle. I'm a uh, senior science editor and Erie historian lately, so this video that I just took will be very useful. Well, you're going to clock this as uh, hours on the job. Absolutely. Yeah, exactly. Just, exactly. just, just one minute. Double overtime. Yeah, on a holiday. Okay. Can we have everybody put up their hands who were friends of Ferdinand Marcos? <laughs> okay, I uh, I think we're everybody was introduced. Um, I I should explain this T-shirt because I've been getting a lot of questions about this. This at Erie was known as the half-ass carabao, and it was worn by the baseball team with dubious distinction. So wait a minute, it was the trophy that was handed yeah. down from team to team. That's the trophy, not the t-shirt. And I still have it. <laughs> okay, uh, I think, uh, Ami, uh, you, maybe you can uh, direct us to uh, the food, huh? Oh, okay. We're just going to go through this door here, and then I, <laughs> I believe the plates and the, school, the utensils um, are here at the beginning of the line, and then you will just... Yeah, but make sure that the covers are, are off. Oh, yeah. yeah, if the covers are there, let, let me remove the covers. <laughs> <laughs> and, yeah, okay. And, uh,